Hello there everybody and welcome, it's Sally here. And yes, it's Tuesday Peaky Fix, even though it's Wednesday. So I'm really sorry if I'm being a bit confusing and knocking your, your week about. Um, but I was off having, as you can see, having a haircut yesterday. So I'm here today and this is the last one actually of uh, the academic year because this is my last week of teaching and it's nice, isn't it, to stop for a break over the holidays for at least some time and I've got a, a pupil, several pupils this afternoon as soon as I finish doing this. But I've actually never known um, an end of year quite like this one because although we are all coming to the end and I think we're all going to give a big sigh of relief, actually we're asking more questions about what, what are we doing in September. Um, than we would normally think about. Normally we'd finish the year and probably put September to one to one side until we had at least a week or two off or we'd already made decisions about timetables and things like that. Some people are really organised, not me. Um, but this year of course is so different because the situation is so up in the air and nobody, and I do mean this, nobody knows what the future uh, brings for us. But we all have to, at some point, make a decision about how you're going to proceed with your teaching in the September. Now, I know there's an awful lot of differences of um, what people are thinking, and I think that's absolutely right. I don't think there is one approach that will suit everybody, because everybody, every single one of you watching, has a different, unique situation and perspective. Now I'm lucky in so many ways because I have just a small teaching studio of just 10, but I do live in, in an Edwardian cottage that has limited space to it. So I've already made the decision and my piano parents will know that I'm staying online until we are a little more certain about the situation. I'm not gonna risk it basically, but I know that other people are needing to go back to face to face just because of the sheer number of pupils that they have. So we want to discuss this further really to help us all face this future with a confidence and a sense of um, um, friendship amongst ourselves. Um, and you might know that we're doing a, a free webinar on Friday morning from 9.30 till 10.30. We'd love you to join us for that. And um, I'll put the registration link just down below once I've finished. And do come along live because that will be really, really um, powerful if you can. Because what we've got is we've got just several teachers from our community who've made different decisions. And we're going to ask them just to discuss and tell us what decisions they've made and why they've come to that decision. Or maybe they haven't made a decision at all because September is still, what, six weeks away. And goodness me, in this life that we're living, an awful lot can happen in six weeks. But we think it's good to share. And we think it's good for us all to literally hold hands and, and give ourselves um, some support in this. So if you're wondering, what am I going to do in September? You're not alone. Many of us are out there thinking exactly the same. So do come and sign up for our, uh, for our webinar. If you can't make it, then we'll put it up on the YouTube channel by the weekend, certainly, and do watch it. And we hope it will provide you with food for thought. Please don't come along expecting it to give you answers because that, uh, you the answer of what you need to do, because it's not going to do that. I'm afraid for this, you have to make a decision for yourself, but based on what we know at any one time. So, uh, I can see various people have come to join me here. Yeah? So, hello, Christine, lovely to see you. Wendy's there, and Katrina is there as well. And uh, yeah, Katrina has just said gloved hands, and I think that is definitely something that is worth considering. So, maybe you could come and tell us more about that on Friday, Katrina. So, thank you all so much. It is Wednesday, but it is the last Tuesday teaching tips for this academic year. If you've watched me all the way through and Thank you so much for, for popping in. I love coming to do these, to be honest. And um, I love thinking about, oh, what could the teaching bit tip be this year, this time? However, if you've got things that you'd like me to talk about, please, please, please do pop them in again down below. And I'm very happy to see if I can give you some help in that direction. Take care, stay safe over the summer, and I'll be back probably mid-September to actually 
the June of Tuesday Future Tips. Okay, but bye for now.